Hey guys, it's Skippy now and I'm one. I got a tutorial today of how to shotgun jump on Modern Warfare 3. I think you'll all be happy to know it's back, so there'll be tons of glitches coming out with shotgun jumps now from everybody. If at any point you need to pause during the video and go back and review, please do that. So basically what you're going to want to do is come to class setup in a private match. Pretty obvious stuff here. You're going to want to set it to unlimited time and score. You're going to want to go down to, uh, after this, you're going to want to go down to friendly fire to enabled. You're going to want to then, after that, go into uh, set shoot set number of lives to unlimited, set health to double, max health to double, and health regeneration to fast. Then go down to create um, default classes. For your primary weapon, you're going to want this, uh, the uh, Shriker because it has the least amount of damage. You're going to want two attachments. You're going to want the grip and the extended mags. Grip is just for increased accuracy, extended mags, so you don't have to reload. Secondary doesn't really matter. Lethal doesn't really matter. Um, tactical, definitely tactical insertion, so if you ever get somewhere and you want to keep going, you have that. Perks, extreme conditioning pro, that's for increased speed. Hardline, in case you need care packages to hop or jump or get higher with. And you want then uh, dead sounds because pro, you have no falling damage, which is highly important. Strike package, you're going to go with assault, and you're going to set your kill streaks to 4, 5, and 10, which is care package, sentry gun, and assault, uh, assault drone. All drop care packages. And that's basically it for your class, guys. You don't need Juggernaut, and you don't need Death Streaks. And then just copy that to both teams if you feel the feel that necessary. Now you're going to come to actually on the map. And on the map, this is on Fallen. This is in the back corner of the map. You're going to need, you're gonna need you and a teammate, obviously, on your team. Okay, so what you're going to do, first off, if you're the one that wants to do it, is going to come up here on this little stone fence, jump over to this pipe, on top of this sign, and then on top of this railing. Come to the corner and there should be a barrier. Have your teammate stay back away from you. In, Mo in Modern Warfare 2, you could stay relatively close to your teammate, but you have to stay back away because fire, uh, friendly fire isn't shared anymore, so you have to stay away from your teammate. So basically what you're going to do is keep counting 1, 2, 3 with the guy with the shotgun. When he says 3, you jump and he'll hit you. And if done correctly, you'll hit up on like this. You can have you or the shotgun person say it, but as long as it's coordinated on 3, you should be able to get up here with no problem. Then, here's another view of it. <clears throat> this is me on the ground. Again, just aim at his ass region and just count to three. When he says, and you're going to have to um, account for voice lag, which voice lag usually takes a second. Over Xbox Live, voice, after you say something, comes in about a second later. So calculate for that, and each friend you have is going to be different. But once you calculate for that, when you count to three, you should be able to get up like this. And it's not that hard to learn, once, especially once you get the hang of it. Um, nothing really special about that glitch. By the way, that was found by RSP Productions originally. I'm just using that as an example. This one we found. This is on the fence. Or not the fence. What the hell am I talking about? This is on the uh, playground on the slide. And this one was a repeat actually from Modern Warfare 2 where you could do this exact same thing. Uh, what you want to do here is just basically run and then get shot and you'll land up on top of here and then plant your tactical insertion and you should be good. Uh, nothing really special about this, but you're up here. Uh, that's actually about it for the video, guys. If this tutorial helped you out, please leave a like, please comment, and if you haven't done so already, please subscribe for more glitching videos.